Hi, welcome to my channel. Thanks for stopping by. Today I'm going to be participating in a Hollywood Glam Tablescape. And this tablescape is hosted by Glamour Ellen, which is Ellen's channel. And it's co-hosted by me, myself, and DIYing It, which is Tammy's channel. And I'm going to go ahead and list both of their channels down below in the description box, along with the complete playlist. So make sure you go and check them out and check out the whole playlist and see what everybody is doing for this Hollywood Glam Tablescape, because there are sure to be a ton of beautiful tablescapes. Now, let's go in here and let me show you what I'm doing for mine. I kind of went with these black swans and you can see on my black swans I put a little bling wrap around their necks just to glam them up a little bit. I am trying to go for that black tie kind of event from old Hollywood style kind of around the time of Bing Crosby and Fred Astaire, Ginger Rogers, Ella Fitzgerald, that whole time period when you just think of the black and the white and the elegance, it reminds me back in that era when the women were so elegant and they would wear the long black gloves up to their elbow with the diamond bracelets around their wrists. And it was just so classy. And that was kind of the look that I was trying to embody with this tablescape. So let's get in here. I'll show you close up. I'm using my real silverware and yes, it is a little tarnished. I need to polish it. I just didn't have time. But next to that silverware, I'm using the silver placemat that I picked up at Walmart. And that is sitting on top of this white tablecloth that I also picked up at Walmart. Now here up above that, I have my leg crystal stemware. And yes, I realized that those are on the wrong side. It's just for filming purposes. It looked better if I put them on this side. But if this was for a real dinner party, I would definitely always put my stemware on the right hand side and not the left. And you can see on the other table setting, it is on the right side. Now on top of this placemat, I'm just gonna go ahead and add in this silver charger. And the silver charger is from the Dollar Tree. And I'm just going to set that right there. And then on top of that silver charger, I'm going to go and add one of these black dinner plates from Dollar Tree. These are my favorite plates. I use these all the time. I use these pretty much daily in my house, but I also use them for a ton of my tablescapes I do because I love these black plates. Now on top of that black plate, I'm going to go ahead and add in this clear salad plate. It looks beautiful on this black plate. It just looks so elegant. And here in the center of this, is some fruit in the center and then a star pattern around the fruit and it's just gorgeous and on top of that I'm going to add in this white linen napkin that I thrifted and this napkin ring that I just went ahead and made I DIY'd this a few months ago and I just think it looks so elegant and pretty so I'm just putting that on top of that salad plate and that is what our place setting is looking like. I think it's very elegant and chic looking. And you can see that this one right here on the other side is the exact replica. Everything's the same except for the fact that the glasses are actually on the correct side on that one. Then here I have a salt and pepper shaker that I have sitting on the table and these are also thrifted. And I love these little salt and pepper shakers. They look very elegant to me. And then up above those, I have this velour fabric loosely wrapped around a mirrored tray. And then on top of the mirrored tray, again, I have these beautiful black swans that I thrifted. I also thrifted this mirrored tray. 
And then behind the black swans, I have a lead crystal candlestick with a glass votive inside of it. And both of those are thrifted as well. Then you can see I have this two-tiered silver tray, which I was thrifted just a, maybe two weeks ago. And so that is looking so elegant, fits in perfect with our black and white and silver theme. And then on each side of our mirrored tray with the swans on it, I've gone ahead and added in these beautiful fans from the Dollar Tree. I thought these were so pretty and the perfect thing for the time period I was going. There was such elegance back then, such class. I love the things that the women wore and the men wore. Even when they were dressed down, they looked so elegant to me. So I hope this has kind of encouraged you to realize that you can put together a beautiful, very chic, very classic and elegant tablescape on a very tight budget with just thrifted items, Walmart items, and Dollar Tree items. Now you can see here on the left side, I even have this gorgeous wine decanter sitting here and that too was thrifted just a few weeks ago. Now some of these items I don't have in a thrift video up yet, but I will have it at the end of this week or the beginning of next week. So if you're interested in seeing how much I paid for each thing, go ahead and watch that. And for the things that I've already shown on the thrift video, I'll go ahead and link that up above and you can see how much I paid for everything. And it is just, it's very, very inexpensive, like I said. So this is a very elegant table. This would be perfect for a dinner party, for a special date night with your significant person, your husband, your boyfriend, girlfriend, whatever it is. This would be lovely as a wedding table set up and you can see how inexpensive it is to put this together and just make this so classic. I love that movie, A White Christmas, with Ella Fitzgerald and Bing Crosby and Danny Kaye. And this is just kind of the time period that I'm kind of embracing for this tablescape. Again, I'll just take you in here and show you these swans and the candlestick and how elegant that looks. I hope that you guys can see that in this. I hope you can see the elegance and the beauty of it. If you like this video, I'd really appreciate it if you can give me a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit the bell so you'll be notified the next time I upload a video. Thanks so much for watching.